Hey what's going on guys, PSV here and welcome to a very special video of me showing you how to do a mods for 1.3 version of City Car Driving Simulator on PC. So simply what you want to do is go over to this website simulatorgamesmods.com I will put the link down in the description and find the car what you want. Some of them, like you can see here, this Ford Focus says 1.2 you can't use those ones, there's only a selected mount on this website so you want to make sure that it says 1.3 because they're the ones that you want to do because that's your version so what we want to do is go into details and download so you see so it has here a picture of the inside and that down here I want to go download direct link hosted by simulator games blah 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 blah, blah, blah click that it opens up in WinRAR so if you haven't got WinRAR quickly you get that because that is a free download so this is basically after you've downloaded it if it doesn't come up in little bottom that it should because by mistake I clicked across so what you're going to do is find it where you where it's downloaded so mine's just in the downloads I open up this it's in WinRAR and you want to click on the Golf GTI that's the one you downloaded so what you do you want to click and drag this and put it onto your put it onto your desktop if the reason it come up saying move and replace it is because I did already put it on there but I just wanted you to see me doing it so once we've moved that to our desktop we get the CCD mod installer come with every download off of that website I have personally downloaded it myself separately but for this video and purpose I'm going to be using the one that does come with the download what is identical to the other one so let's open this application up. So you just click yes. It says city car driving folder cannot be defined. Do you want to define it yourself? That's because I've taken it out of my area and placed it onto my desktop. Yes. If that does come up, then you simply just try and find it in your folder and then drag it to your desktop. Then jobs are good. So here you see it says city car driving. Just click on that. Click OK. And you come to, a, and this is the installer, the mod installer. So let's click choose mod. So this is where you need to click and drag. You can put it to your desktop. It makes a life ten times easier. It makes the download, it makes the mod a lot quicker. So what what we want to do, we like I said, click on choose mod. Go to desktop because you've already dragged that to your desktop, and there it is. Click OK. So that's picked up that it's in there. Now we want to do is click install mod. Okay, that's success. 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 Put my teeth back in, and uh, right, successful. And click OK. And there we go. Done. So I'm going to jump into seat car driving so you can see me actually proof that this does work. So now you can see that I'm actually in city car driving the game itself. So what I do is click on free drive. Select your vehicle, ignore that. Go right across, just flick through them. And there it is. Okay, it looks uh, a bit different to what I expected. But anyway, there's that is the vehicle. It's the estate version. Okay, yeah, so that is basically the vehicle that we installed it. And if you want to change the colour, just click on colour. There you go, that's it in red. The reason it looks different is because it had a front view. But this is the vehicle that we installed. So yeah, there it is. So here are some of the vehicles that I've purchased off that website before. Ignore that, ignore that. And so on. So yeah, guys, uh, please ensure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos like this. I'm going to be doing a mod, how to install mods onto Euro Truck Simulator and stuff like that. And look out, if you haven't checked out part one of... Uh, city car driving check that out because that's quite cool and there will be another part out very shortly where i'll be using a modded car so then guys i hope you all enjoyed like i said please give this thumbs up if this tutorial helped you and i'll see you guys in my next video